I think always a concern that anything could uh, hurt a student. Yeah, some concerns out there tonight. The close call tense moments for people in a Hollister neighborhood after fire broke out in their backyard. Firefighters able to get it under control quickly. Why were they able to get it under control so quickly? We're going to explain. Good evening. It's great to be with you tonight. That fire also near that elementary school you just saw right there. KION's Donya Romero spoke to fire officials and people at the school as well as a professor of fire ecology. She leads us off tonight from Hollister. Donya, how close was this fire to homes? Well, right behind me is where the fire happened, as you can tell by the burned areas. But right over here, just a few yards away, are people's homes, and on the other side, a school. And anything close to the children is obviously a little nerve-wracking. At around 4 o'clock Monday evening, a vegetation fire broke out near a neighborhood and a school in Hollister. We, we always try to prepare for anything. The principal at R.O. Hardin Elementary School says she was a little nervous about the 250 children attending summer school, but says they're prepared. I think there's always the concern that, you know, a student might get hurt in any situation. Um, but no, I do feel pretty confident with our, just our procedures or protocols uh, that we have in place. Although the fire was only an acre and contained in about 30 minutes, the Hollister Fire Department says it could have been a lot worse. Fortunately, um, there was a rapid, uh, moderate rate of spread, but fortunately, um, the lot had actually been abating. So we had uh, got through the process and got that uh, lot taken care of for the weeds for our annual process. So fortunately, that was in there. Kate Wilkin is a professor at San Jose State University. She says mitigating an area twice a year is standard, which is what the Hollister Fire Department says they do, but says fires are still a concern by the way the grass is looking this time of year. As we look around the hillsides around us, they're going from green to, to they went from green to beautiful flowers, back to green, and now they're kind of starting to brown. And so as all of those annual grasses die for the year, we can expect more fires to be able to sweep through them. I think our, our administration will definitely take that into consideration and um, work with the fire department to make sure that it's a safe place for children. Now, fire officials tell me they think a firework started the fire, but it's still under investigation. Reporting live in Hollister, Daniel Romero, KION News Channel 46. All right, Daniel, we appreciate it. The principal at the elementary school says she feels very secure in their procedures if there is a fire in that area.